cold out here, but we do have something that is warm and it'll be very soothing for this type of oh, environment. Oh, yeah. And speaking of cold, well, let's address this awesome shirt. Right. Iceman. There you go, so right? So you guys have a partnership with them. It's a perfect combo. We do. And, you know, in the Publix, the jersey they bought, this is last year's jersey, but this year's jersey was at a Chicken Tender Pub Sub. <laughs> it is all the rage. So kudos to Michelle over in our, our field marketing person for uh, putting that together. But it's been great. But we love our partnership with the Iceman. We love the opportunity that they give us uh, just to be around all the people that attend. But there's other opportunities that come with that. One is we get to feed the team on some of their post-game meals. And yet, it goes a little bit further, they were coming into our kitchen. So we have our second round of Iceman players coming in. So if you want to come meet the players, see what they do, you can sign up for our class on the 25th. It's a 6.30 class. And you can come in and experience some of the food that we feed them, except for the dessert. We don't feed them dessert. But <laughs> Do they ask for it? Or they're like, they, hey, they, you get dessert? And they're well, like, no. We're not there long enough for them to tell us, right? <laughs> we come in, we drop it, and then we run. But, you know, this is one of the things that we're going to serve Tuesday night. And then this is, we're actually going to serve this to them tomorrow night for their post-game meal. So this is a pan-seared chicken with Dijon cream sauce and roasted garlic mashed potatoes is what we got going on here. So that's, uh, that's what we're going to do. So I've seared some chicken off in this front pan right here. So I'm going to have you go ahead and take it out because it's good to go. Yeah. And, and then, you were saying this is a post-game meal, correct? Post-game meal, right? So, so they've been on the ice, and these cats are hungry. Let me tell you, they expend a lot of energy, so we have to make you? sure. You can take them all out if you want. All right. So once that chicken gets seared, we go in with some shallots, a little bit of garlic, soften those up. Then we hit it with chicken stock to go in. And then that chicken stock reduces a little bit of cream, not heavy cream, right? Because we're trying to watch their fat intake. Sure. So we'll go a little bit lighter with just regular uh, whipping cream. And that cooks down by half. Then we hit it with a little Dijon mustard, which we have in here right here. I'm going to grab this spoon right there. You see that Dijon oh, mustard, yeah. Yeah. right? And then we're not done because we need to add one more piece to it. I have some light sour cream to fold in here as well. And this is going to give it a little bit of body and make it a little bit of smoother as, as we put it on top of the chicken, right? Oh, I see. So, yeah, you're going to cook that up, and then you're going to put it on top there. Like right. A I mean, look, look, how, look how smooth that sauce yeah. has just come out just from that right there. So, all right, I'm going to grab your plate. I got some roasted garlic mashed potatoes over here. I'm going to put some of those on here. I'm going to spoon some of this sauce, right? One, we're going to get it in the potatoes. And then just to make sure the chicken gets covered, like that. And we do feed them vegetables in case wow. anybody's concerned about these there's, gentlemen. There's vegetables in there. But you know that, like you said, too, this is for their post-game meal. And if you think about it, hockey is so demanding. Yes. It's a tough sport. So this is perfect for your entire family, like after a hard day of work or school or maybe, you know, any of the sports they're playing. Well, think about how cold it is right now. These guys are on the ice for a That's long true. time. So they need something warm and comforting, but at the same time, it still needs to be healthy. So we're, we're, they can continue their, their athleticism the next day because they play a grueling schedule where they're day after day, get on the bus and ride and play day after day and keep moving. So we want to keep them, keep them there. And one more time on the class coming up. So it's on the 25th. You can register at 904-262-4187. It's the Jacksonville Iceman class. It starts at 630. We'll have four players there to uh, come up and do demonstrations with us, and uh, we'll serve you food and have a paired beverage with it. Chef Tony, this is excellent. I love this. It's a little bit of a twist. I haven't had this before, and I'm going to get some, uh, some of the potatoes in there. Mm, delicious right there. A little green bean. And now I taste the mustard after mix in, after you put it on top. Yes. It's a great combo. So this recipe will be on newsforjackson.com slash recipes. And don't forget to stop in to your neighborhood public store to get all these quality ingredients. Thanks again. I'm going to keep on eating. Stick around. More to come right after this.